Welcome back to Done With Depression. I just got back from the Kaiser Hospital and I got my stitches out. I don't know if you guys can see that or not, but healed up pretty good, got my stitches out, and I am found out I am going to have to have surgery on my jaw to correct my bite. So when I bite down like this, the front teeth over here um, contact first and it's not even all the way around like it was before the fall and so they're gonna have to do surgery uh, put me under and they screw screws essentially into your bone and then they put really heavy rubber bands around the screws to keep your mouth completely shut so they don't really call it uh, being wired shut anymore because I guess that gives people anxiety but it's essentially rubber bands um, that they do so he seemed pretty adamant about it he wanted to get the surgery started within the next 48 hours and so I'm gonna be going in uh, pretty soon here to have surgery but I uh, got a packet that has just stuff about the surgery in it what to do what not to do I got a surgery box which is kind of cool and bag full of medicine <laughs> four medicines to be exact post-surgery medicines got that and I stopped at Starbucks <laughs> on the way home so that was a nice little treat uh, but we're gonna open up this box here because it is pretty funny what is inside of the box so this is a, a pre-surgery box, I guess is what you would call it. Um, let's see here. So it has some stuff about uh, your routine. It's kind of like a calendar sort of thing. Pain control activity, eating and drinking, tobacco, mouth care, other steps. It tells you what to do the day of the surgery, morning before, 12, out, 12 hours after, etc., etc., blah, blah, blah. Um, this one, surgery preparation, what to do, what not to do, blah, blah, blah. But this one is the funniest thing I've ever seen. And I really didn't believe it when they told me, but they have this picture here. And you're supposed to take a shower and then sanitize yourself with these pads in this order from top to bottom and front to back. You're supposed to sanitize yourself and somehow that is supposed to help with mouth surgery. Not sure, none of it has to do with your mouth at all, but you sanitize yourself with these pad things from front to back. So that's in here. And then there's what I call a Gatorade drink. It says uh, pre-op hydration and nutrition. Complex carbs and such. 200 calories. Clear liquid. Uh, filtered water is the number one ingredient. Looks to be vegan. I don't know. It's from Kaiser. Uh, you're supposed to drink this before supposedly and what else do we have a bag of stuff for you to do something with I don't know maybe you put everything in the bag instead of putting it in the box and I also got a free mask free mask so uh, when I went to Kaiser I, you have to wash your hands before you go into the building at all. And you wash your hands and they watch you and then you kind of get in line and they filter you to go in through the front and they ask you if you have any corona symptoms and all that stuff. They gave me a free mask and then kind of pointed me to where I wanted to go 
and they gave me a little sticker that said that they asked me questions or whatever on this day. So they're um, just checking to see everyone that's going in and out. They did not check my temperature on the way in, which I thought was kind of strange. But when I got into the room that I was supposed to be in, they checked my temperature. But I think that's just a standard procedure and not part of COVID. So it was a little strange that they didn't check your temperature at the front. Um, washing your hands, I guess, and wearing a mask is good, but they didn't check my temperature. Anyway, so I'm going to be having surgery within the next 48 hours and I don't know I'm a little bit nervous but not too much I'm pretty calm about it I'm still gonna be here either way and it seems a little strange to have screws driven into your bones in your mouth to hold rubber bands to keep your jaw shut but once you get past that it doesn't seem too bad I guess um, I'll continue to be on the liquid diet, which I'm already on. I did sneak some uh, Mother's Day cake yesterday, but it had a lot of frosting, so it was pretty soft. And I didn't chew it, I just swallowed it. But uh, liquid diet <laughs> includes Starbucks, liquid diet, mango dragon fruit, lemonade, light ice. Get on that level. If you don't know, now you know. The mango dragon fruit lemonade. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I will see you guys after surgery, and I'll see you next time on Done with Depression.